for all integer n greater than or equal to 0 for the power of 3n minus 1 is divisible by 9 6 raised to n minus 1 is divisible by 9 by 5 for all positive integer n dear all don't forget to subscribe like share and comment if you subscribe it don't forget to like it and now let us restart from questions number one for all integer n greater than or equal to zero for the power of three n minus one is it divisible by nine now we can prove this using a principle of mathematical inductions by using the following steps step one for n is equal to zero means that's for the power of three times zero minus one and the three the power three times zero is which is zero then for the power of zero is one one minus one is zero zero is divisible by nine which is true step two is assumption assume that it is true for n is equal to k that is for the power of three k minus one is divisible by nine this implies that or we can rewrite as for the power of 3k minus 1 is equal to 9 times d for all integer d greater than or equal to 0 or for some d greater than or equal to 0. This implies that or by rearranging this by rearranging the statement we have for the power of 3k is equal to 9d plus 1. Step 3. We want to show that it is true for n is equal to k plus 1. That means for the power of 3 into k plus 1 minus 1. That means for the power of 3k plus 3 minus 1 is divisible by 9. And our claim becomes for the power of 3k plus 3 minus 1 is equal to 9 times m for all m integer greater than or equal to Zero. Now starting from the left hand side of our claim, that is for the power of 3k plus 3 minus 1 and applying the rule for exponential, that means for the power of 3k times for the power of 3 minus 1 and substituting or using step 2 for the power of 3k becomes 9d plus 1 and for the power of 3 is 64 and this is equal with 9d plus 1 times 64 minus 1 and multiplying this 9d plus 1 by 64 we have 9d times 64 plus 64 minus 1 but 64 minus 1 is 63 that is 9d times 64 plus 63. Here we have a common 9. And this is equal with 9 into d times 64 plus 7. This is equal with 9 times m, where m is equal to d times 64 plus 7. And since d is greater than or equal to 0, so d times 64 plus 7 is also greater than or equal to 0. Now this implies that for the power of 3k plus 3 minus 1 is equal to 9m implies that for the power of 3k plus 3 minus 1 is divisible by 9, which is the required result. Thus, it is true for all integer n greater than or equal to 0. Number 2. Prove that 6 is a power of n minus 1 is divisible by 5 for all positive integer n. Now to prove this using the principle of mathematical inductions, we follow the following steps. Step 1. For n is equal to 1. For n is equal to 1, we have 6 is a power of 1 minus 1. And 6 is a power of 1 is 6. 
6 minus 1 is 5. And 5 is divisible by 5. This is true. Step 2. Or the assumptions part says that assume that it is true for m is equal to k. This implies that 6 to the power of k minus 1 is divisible by 5. This implies that 6 to the power of k minus 1 is equal to 5 times d. Again, by rearranging this, we have 6 to the power of k is equal to 5d plus 1. For all positive integer d. Step 7. Step 3 says that we want to show that it is true for n is equal to k plus 1. That means our claim becomes 6 to the power of k plus 1 minus 1 is divisible by 5. That means 6 to the power of k plus 1 minus 1 is 5 times m for all positive integer m. So starting from the left hand side of our claim, this 6 to the power of k plus 1 minus 1, we obtain this condition. That means 6 to the power of k plus 1 minus 1. And by applying exponential rule here in 6 to the power of k plus 1, we have 6 to the power of k or times 6 minus 1 or 6 times 6 to the power of k minus 1. But from step 2, 6 to the power of k is 5d plus 1. Then use 5d plus 1 by or replace by 6 to the power of k, we have 6 times 5d plus 1 minus 1 since 6 to the power of k is 5d plus 1. Again, multiplying this by 6, we have 6 times 5d plus 6 minus 1. Again, here 6 minus 1 is 5. So we have 6 times 5d plus 5. Again, here we have a common 5. So we have 5 into 6d plus 1. This is equal with 5 times m, where m is equal to 5d plus 1. Since d is greater than or equal to or for d, d is a positive integer. So 6d plus 1, or which is m is also positive integer. This implies that 6k plus 1 minus 1 is equal to 5 times m, which is a required result, or 6 to the power of k plus 1 minus 1 is divisible by 5. So that this is true for n greater than or equal to 1. Dear all, don't forget to like, subscribe, share these channels. And we will continue the other questions on the other parts. And thanks for watching this channel.